just as I thought I was done recording. Guess what I see on Twitter that came out. Gargura Tokyo Wabi Sabi Lullaby. <laughs> Whole live X Honeyworks. Y'all know how I love my Honeyworks. So I have to react to this. Uh, definitely excited. Gura off rip fits this vibe with her, uh, you know, cuteness. Let's get it. I was gonna have a little time. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay, a little low fighting, maybe? But also sweet? Ooh. Okay. Wow, okay, a little bit more powerful than I was expecting. I, I, I was expecting something on the, the, the sug more sugary side, but I'll definitely take this. Mm. Obviously, I didn't think about the lullaby part, and then I hear the lullaby thing, but it makes sense now. Up. Love that, ha, ha. In the background. Yeah, definitely. Even from Honeyworks, I wasn't expecting this. More than Gura, I wasn't expecting this from a Honeyworks thing. I mean, they've done different tracks in the past, but like, I don't know. I've just been too conditioned by Honeyworks as of late, maybe. Um, to expect this. Guys, okay, let's look at our official releases, right? Reflect, Shinkiro, Q, Sweet Appetite, Nonfiction. Journey Like a Thousand Years that I haven't heard and a few other collabs that I haven't heard. So outside of those four that I haven't heard, the five that I mentioned first. This could eat this could be our best song. I get it. Reflect is a classic. It's not bad at all. It's a pretty good song. But this is a good ass song. Shinkiro's pretty good too. And they're both pretty recent, so it's kinda hard to put a finger on it, especially when I haven't finished listening to this one. But this feels like a very, very complete Gargura song. That's the other thing. Shinkiro is a collab, so it's a bit uh, harder to put a finger on how well her performance is because it's more of how well she matches with uh, Asensio uh, as opposed to her standing out all the time because, you know, you want there to be the, the chemistry, the the uh, um, synergy. When this, it, it, this is her shining at her best, I think. This is amazing. This is actually amazing. And... It's on the more emotional side. Yeah, th okay. I'm not going to tell y'all what to think, because everyone should think for themselves. I think it's a pretty valuable thing that we as humans bring to the table. But for me personally... Gura's best song. It's a great track. It's so soothing, dude. I'm saying this to my friend John right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta send this to him. He's a girl fan too. Why are we sending each other like girl photos and shit? Where is it? 
I've gotten him in Asensio as well. Unfortunately, I haven't gotten him in Suise. But I think he's more into like the gimmicky ones than like the straight forward ones, which makes sense. Check this out. All caps, by the way. Ultra Mega Banger. And I spelled banger wrong. I spelled it B-A-N-G-E-W-R. What a fucking idiot. Let's keep going. This video is great too. I haven't talked about it, but this What a great timing on that. What a great mix. Kuro, Sancho. Hey guys. Oh, oh, oh. Rewind the tape? Or is that it? And then we get credits or something. I don't know. I won't skip the credits this time because last time I got crucified. I'm sorry. It was an accident. I really didn't mean any harm by it. Yeah. Awesome. 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 That is definitely my favorite girl song. That was absolutely amazing. This guy couldn't have said it any better. It's very comfy. Like, it's a very comforting song. Very soothing. While also, while also, having substance. Which I'm not saying every song has to have substance. But, it is nice when it does and it's done well. So yeah, shout out to Gurren, shout out to Gunny Works, shout out to Whole Life. Did I say Gunny Works? Honey Works, I'm sorry. God damn. Black Friday is making me a bit loopy. Well, there's only like three and a half hours left. I better get the shop in. I'm out of here. Peace.